My name is Lisa Peterson. I'm the Deputy City Manager for the City of Cambridge. In addition to the operating budget, the capital budget is a significant portion of the City's financial plan. The public investments that are funded through the capital budget affect the City for years to come. Significant capital projects include things from school reconstruction projects to municipal facilities including our fire stations and youth centers to reconstructing our streets and sidewalks to make sure that they're available and working well for all users. And of course there's a lot of work that we're also doing to maintain our vast urban forest. So two projects that are underway that are very exciting is one is the King Open and Cambridge Street Upper School and Community Complex both located in East Cambridge. And this project involves the total reconstruction of the lower school, the upper school, the preschools and community school programs that are run by the Department of Human Services, the, um, a new home for the school administration building, uh, enhanced and expanded Valente Branch Library. The Gold Star Pool, which also is expanded, will include a, a waiting pool and a larger pool for the neighborhood. And uh, by putting the parking underground, we're able to increase the amount of open space for this neighborhood by over an acre, which is what we're very proud of and it's something that is very important in this densely populated neighborhood. The second school reconstruction project is happening on the western side of the city, which is the Tobin Montessori and Vaseline Upper Schools. And the goal of this project is to make sure that we're really meeting some of the future projected enrollment needs of the school department, as well as the needs of additional preschool classrooms. These two school reconstruction projects represent almost $400 million in city investment. The River Street project was authorized in uh, last year's budget and it is ongoing. Fundamentally the River Street project is um, reconstructing the utility infrastructure and while we're doing that we're able to really reimagine how the streets and sidewalks and bike lanes should be reconfigured. And of course included in that, we have the great opportunity of being able to reimagine Carl Baron Plaza to see how it can work best for everyone. In the port area, we're also doing a very significant sewer and stormwater management program. And the opportunity there is not only to reduce the flooding, it, but it also uh, is to reconstruct the streets and sidewalks that really best work for the neighborhood. In fiscal year 20, there are additional significant funds that have been put in to increase our investment to affordable housing. And this is really significant because these monies are really going towards creating new affordable housing units. These represent just some of the projects in the capital budget. I invite you to look at the website to get more information. Thank you.